Hello and a warm welcome to all of you. What is fundamental attribution error? Have you heard this term? It is the tendency to attribute others' behavior to dispositional factors while attributing your own behavior to situational factors. What does it mean? If I am doing well, it's because of my skills. If I am doing badly, I am plain unlucky. If you are doing well, you are lucky. And if you are doing badly, you are really bad. My name is Shankar Vishwanath. I am a fellow channel accountant and an emotional intelligence coach. And today I am going to tell you how you can avoid fundamental attribution error. Let me begin with a beautiful story. Naraji, widely known as Devarishi, used to think that he is the greatest devotee of Lord Vishnu. So once he went to Lord Vishnu and asked him to testify that he is his greatest devotee. And Lord Vishnu told him, maybe you are not. He asked him, who is it then? He said, there is a farmer. I think he is a bigger devotee than you. And Naraji got really wild. So he goes to see who this farmer is. He stealthily goes and observes him and finds that the farmer prays in the morning and in the evening and is a normal person otherwise. So he comes back and complains to Vishnu, this is not fair. He is just plain lucky that you are telling that he is the greatest devotee. Look at me, I take your name 24 hours a day. So Lord Vishnu gives him a little activity. He gives him a little vessel filled up to the brim with oil and tells him to take a parikrama or a circle of the world making sure that not a drop of oil spills onto the ground. Naraji says, that's easy for me, I'll do it. So he goes, takes an entire parikrama and comes back to Lord Vishnu and says, look, I have done it. Not a drop of oil has spilled onto the ground. Now testify that I am your greatest devotee. Lord Vishnu asks him one question. How many times did you take my name during the Parikrama? And Naraji says, what a question is this? How do you expect me to take your name when I was in a situation that was so tough? And this is what Lord Vishnu explains to him. He takes him to the farmer's place and asks him to re-observe him. The farmer prays in the morning, the farmer prays while doing work on the farm, the farmer prays while he is resting, the farmer prays after he comes back from his farm, the farmer prays before having his dinner, the farmer prays before going to bed. And so Lord Vishnu tells him, look at him. He is taking my name throughout the day, no matter what situation he is in. And when I put you into this situation, you are giving that as an excuse to say that you did not take my name. Naraji understood. This is a tendency many people tend to have. Do you doubt people's behavior? Do you not give them the benefit of the doubt? The next time you find doing it, be sure that you are getting caught in fundamental attribution error. How can you avoid it? Do not jump to conclusions about people's behavior overtly. Give them the benefit of doubt. And if there is a slightest semblance of doubt in your mind, talk it out. Don't judge them. Don't have fundamental attribution error. It will help you a long way in building your relationships and improving your social skills and thereby improving your emotional intelligence. If you like this video, please share it and do click the like button and do offer your comments. I shall be eagerly awaiting to hear from you. Until next time, this is Shankar Vishwanath signing off, asking you to take good care of yourself. Goodbye and God bless.